While stuck at home, some people have decided to get themselves into a very sticky situation. That's the case for Anna Nall. She graduated summa cum laude from Palm Desert High School, and now she is one of five finalists in this year's Stuck at Prom Scholarship from Duck Brand Duct Tape. It is good to meet you. You are an overachiever, I think. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. <laughs> All right, so you are wearing the creation that you created for the contest. Now, tell me a little bit about kind of the rules of the contest. Does it all have to be made out of tape? Um, yeah, well, they allow us to use different materials if we want to. So this dress, like we made this base out of muslin, and then we just attached all the tape and all these flowers. Some of them are painted, but most of them are made out of tape. Um, the sleeves um, are out of tape as well. We laser cut them so they would look in like a beautiful like flower and like butterfly pattern. I think you have fashion on your mind a lot, don't you? <laughs> I do, I do. Um, at school I was the head of social media for our fashion club. So I would post everything on Instagram and like for spirit weeks and everything. I would try to like inspire people what to wear. And then um, with my sister, I have a fashion blog and an Instagram page. So this contest, you could win up to $10,000 if you're the winner. Well, I think it's sort of crazy that I could win that amount of money, like my college tuition. Like I wouldn't have to take as many loans. It would be great. It would be a great contribution. Um, and in terms of prospects, I think that I have a decent chance. I know there are a couple people ahead of me, but um, I think with this interview and I've been promoting myself on Facebook and Instagram and everything else, I have um, friends all around Europe who are supporting me and are voting for me every day. And yesterday I was promoted on an Instagram page, with like 66 K like thousand followers. So I think it, we're getting there. We just had a slower start, but yeah, but now you we only have until uh, July 11th to get the votes in. Is that yes. correct? All right. Yes. So that's what we can do. And what's the website that we go to in order to vote? Yeah, you just Google Stuck at Prom or it's on the duckbrand.com website. And then I'll, we'll see your picture there, too. Yeah, you just have to click on like vote now or something. They're going to tell you, oh, here are the finalists for 2020. And then you click on vote now and you'll see my picture there. And so how did you come up with a concept for the outfit? How long did it take you to do it? How many rolls of tape did you go through? I chose the theme of like peonies, the flowers, because they used to be my grandma's favorite flower. And after she died, we just kind of had like that's like we always have peonies in our house and everything like that so it's our favorite flower now too <laughs> and um so i was coming up with the concept with my sister because we usually work together on these things and um yeah sh we were just like oh, okay we're going to use the colors that peonies have and then i just made some also like rose tapes and stuff because i asked our asb president what our prom theme was supposed to be and she said one of the themes they were thinking about was the rose garden. And I was like, oh, perfect. This would work great. And so how many rolls of tape did you go through? Um, not that many, to be honest. They were like 20 yards um, rolls. So I only went through around 10 of them. We tried to be as efficient as possible. Yeah. Now, I mentioned you're an overachiever. You know, how many schools did you apply to? How many did you get accepted? Where are you going? You know, all that. I applied to around um, 19 schools, I think, a lot of schools. Um, I got into like half of them, I think, but um, I'm going to UC Berkeley in the fall. And will you be studying fashion? Um, I don't think so. It's more of a hobby for me, just something I like to do in my free time. I'm going to study something along the lines of linguistics and foreign languages. Congratulations to you. Congratulations on uh, going to college in the fall. I know you're going to be a high achiever in college as well. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. Congratulations. We hope you win. Thank you. I hope so, too. <laughs> <laughs> I bet. All right. Thank you, Anna. All right. Stay right there. We'll be right back.